when we start our business we think it's going to be easy sure it's going to take some work but i don't think we truly understand what lies ahead of us more often than not it's our first second or third attempt at business and we're still failing i'm natasha vanzetti your discovery coach and in this video i want to share with you why i believe failure is actually good for your business before we keep going let me first of all define fail now some of you may see failure purely as financial failure now, although that is part of it, I also believe that failure is when you realize that the business that you've created or the business that you're building just doesn't feel right anymore. You see, for me, success is about building a business that is both emotionally and financially sustainable. Okay, there is no point just doing it for the money because I tried that for years in my corporate life and I just felt miserable. Failure is that moment when you tried something and it just didn't feel right. You just couldn't get the traction or momentum you needed to make it work. But failure also means that you're building momentum. You're out there trying new things instead of sitting there waiting, procrastinating for the perfect conditions. Your business will evolve as you do and you'll learn lessons along the way with each and every one of your failures. Failure is feedback, plain and simple. We all have failures in our life, some bigger than others. It's what we learn from these failures along the way that counts. Some of my biggest ahas have come from my failures and I'm thankful every day that life never went as I totally planned it to be. One of the ways to reduce the number of these failures is to pay attention in the early days about what it is you actually want to do. Not what you think you should do or what you have been doing, but what you want to do. You have to pay attention to how things feel. Now, anything new will feel a little bit scary and that's okay. But what you want to pay attention to is how you feel when you're doing the work. Does it energize you? Does it excite you? Does it make you want to dream bigger and better? Or does it make you want to close down your laptop, head out the door, never to be seen again? Don't let failure stop you from chasing the dream of what you really want to create, okay? Acknowledge the lesson, pivot and move on. Again, reminder, failure is simply feedback. That is all. So you have to pay attention to the lessons. Think about how the, doing the work makes you feel. If you're creating a business that is right for you, then it's you're going to feel energized. You're going to feel like you want to create bigger and better along the way. You want to do the best you can possibly do. A failure is when you're working on something that just, it doesn't do it for you. You're not feeling it and you're really not that excited about it anymore. So know that you're not alone. Please share this video with other people that need that little reminder that failure is feedback and it's actually good for your business. And also know that discovery is one of the most important and vital parts of building and creating your business. Because you don't want to discount it, you don't want to blow it off, you want to spend the time in the early days to lay that foundation and discover what it is you're really here to do. Discover how your story contributes to what you're creating. And also to discover your style and how you actually want to work with people. So go out there, fail as often as you can, keep that momentum going, but pay attention acknowledge the lessons, pivot and move on. I'll talk to you soon. Bye.